The levitating singer was the big winner at a female-dominated awards which saw Little Mix make history as the first female group to win the Best British Group Prize. Tuesday night's Brit Awards marked a return of live music following the coronavirus pandemic with 4,000 people in attendance as part of the government's live events pilot scheme. Some 2,500 tickets were gifted to key workers from the Greater London area many of whom wore blue. DUA Lipa won both Best Female Solo Artist and the coveted Best Album Award, using her first speech to call for a pair eyes for NHS workers and her second to demand a posthumous bravery award for 20-year-old Fala Jimmy Alyabunmi Adul, who recently died after jumping into the River Thames to save a woman. During her acceptance speeches she picked up the female solo artist Gong Lippa said, it's very good to clap for them, but we need to pay them. I think what we should do is, we should all give a massive massive round of applause and give Boris Johnson a message that we all support a fair pair eyes for our frontline. Cabinet Minister George Eustace stressed there is a difficult public finance environment in response to her speech. Environment Secretary Eustace told BBC Breakfast, there's been a pair eyes, it was announced. There's been a pay freeze for most of the public sector, and it's also important to recognize that in recent years, that there have been some pay rises as well particularly for nurses and the lower paid. We know that it is a difficult public finance environment as well, so we can't always go as far as you'd like, but it's also the case that there's also a pair of you that's going on into the NHS. Audience members attending the indoor ceremony were not socially distanced or required to wear face coverings one seated. However, they needed proof of a negative lateral flow test result to enter the venue, and will be required to provide details to NHS test and trace, and follow government guidance while traveling.